Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. I'm a little high. Beep, beep. There we go. Welcome to another striker break. I've got something real special for you today. Not just baseball cards, not just the, the brand new, newest five star sealed case breaks. Not only that, but also Bowman's best. Just, I mean, that's not going to start. Let's go. Series one. Actually, I got something better than that. Let's see if this works. What are the odds that this actually works? I don't know, but I'm going to try. You ready? This is breaking news with Striker Breaks. Today's top story is Ellie De La Cruz predicts 80 stolen bases this season. Why? Because he says he likes running. Matt McLean, second baseman slash shortstop for the Cincinnati Reds, tweaks his oblique on an injury that's over six months old. Aaron Judge has what I like to call a slippery toe that will require maintenance for the rest of his career. And everyone's favorite injury-prone White Sox, which one? Eloy Jimenez has a goal to play 150 games this season. Good luck, my friend. Jeremy Pena overhauled his batting stance and swing mechanics and wants to pull the ball this year. Here's hoping Jeremy Pena gets it together. And Byron Buxton. Another injury-prone player that just needs to put a full season together says he wants to get 30 stolen bases this season. If he can get it done, he's going to be a first-round talent. The Texas Rangers, the world champion Texas Rangers, are flirting with the idea of having three catchers on the active roster this season, leaving the door wide open for future Hall of Famer Sam Huff to get some playing time. And the Marlins are willing to have Tim Anderson be their everyday shortstop this year. There's only one catch. He's going to have to take $2 million a season. And finally, Tarek Skubal, the Detroit Tigers ace, hit 100 miles per hour on the last pitch of BP. On Tuesday, I'm calling Tarek Skubal Cy Young 2024. This has been breaking news with Striker Breaks. Did it work? Did it work? I don't know. Is that going to work? Okay. Let me know if you can still hear me and see me. New segment. Can you still hear the music? Jordan card was not fake, Bri. Give me a five by five. You can hear me. <laughs> I don't know why I don't have me. Oh, there we go. We got some desktop audio. Okay. <laughs> what a what an S show. Five by five. Sweet sassy molassy. I guess we're ready to go then. How about now? Is the music back in? Okay. Okay, cool. All right. Break number one. Ready to go. Five star. Do we start with this? No. Let's bust into one of these. What did you guys think? Can, was it okay? I threw it together quickly, and by quickly, I mean 27 hours of editing. No, not, not that bad. But I was thinking about, there was just so much news. I'm like, man, I got to report some of this. I was 
that time of year. We're gonna we're gonna leave these boys up on the stage. Kind of mix it up a little bit. A couple boxes of this, a couple of boxes of that. Striker breaks the news, indeed, Scott. What about the weather? Okay. Suggestions. Go ahead. I'm down. Like real ones. And I guess funny ones, too. They're allowed. Only real suggestions and funny ones. If you're trying to be funny and it's not funny, banned for life. Better think long and hard before you put something in the chat. Was that it? That was a five. It was a five. So what? It's all I can afford. Hit number one is Trevor Hoffman. Silver signatures to 25. Yes. Castillo. Congratulations, 18 of 25. And what is this behind here? Young Nick Prado, rookie auto. Are we numbered? Unnumbered? Unnumbered? Is this blurry? Uh, we, we don't need any blurriness. Make sure everything's okay. All right, we're good. My, my gigantic fit. Hold on. Let me get my gigantic grill out of here. Make it a little smaller. I made it bigger for the news. That's a little better. You don't need to see all that me. One moment. Trying to work out what size everything, if those are 130s or what. Let's do another one. Are they 130s? Are they 180s? Do we need thick sleeves? What's happening? Jeff wondering how poker went on Monday. It didn't go great. I busted out with an ace jack against pocket fours. Classic. Classic. What are you going to do? new video coming out soon and you're gonna like it i already recorded it but i haven't edited it carlton fisk golden graphs man five star is pretty cool looking this year i'm liking it carlton fisk going to william golden graph that looks sweet Next up, Natty, C.J. Abrams auto. Going to John. I don't know how much room we're going to have up here with, with this stuff on the stage. So we're just going to, I'm going to do half of the case now. Mix in a couple of Series 1 boxes, and then we'll do the second half of the case. This is probably going to go pretty quick. I estimated 45 minutes, but I don't really know. Larkin 
Speaking of teal, Scott. Teal Barry Larkin, number to 75. What a sig. What a sig. We got a red set here for Joshua. Followed by JJ Blade. These are quite thick cards. Gold embroidery. Gold leafing on the sides. They're heavy. If you get a box of five star, you're going to need some thick boys. Probably. 180s. Gonna need some 180s. And you can use the code STRIKEFORCE at cardshells.com to get a little discount. Hello, Chris. You're welcome, Phil. Cards, cars, and guitars says, I bet every striker video made has a thumbs up from me on it. I love to hear it. Yeah, dude. Fanatics Blaster, Fanatics Value Box Rip coming tomorrow. Hopefully, if I can get, I, oh God, I'm so busy. But hopefully it comes tomorrow. You're going to want to watch it. That I can promise you. So ring the notification bell so you know when I go live and post a video. Tristan Casas, rookie. Auto. Another Red Sox hit. And a Teal O'Hoppy to 75. Going to Elazar. How many can we fit? I think we got some room now. Let's get into the flagship, eh? Start with a hobby. Oh, Poor. Yeah, I've seen those, Chris. Top loader binders. Oh, good to hear, Phil. Silver pack. Five star case hit. Yeah, I don't know. I haven't watched anybody open it. This is the first. It's the first I'm seeing it. Should be something pretty nasty though. They've got cut sigs, cut autos, cut sigs in here. That would be sweet. Good morning, Greenskeeper. Hit that like button. We're already at 500 viewers. 100 likes. Let's use this momentum. These are the brand new ones, Charlie. 2023 five star. It's a late release, so 2024 five star will be like a year from now, probably. We're going to need a bigger stage. It says ripping for rookies. New aluminum stands are nice, Nick. Indeed. Silver and gold are supposed to be case hits. Okay, so we already got a silver and a gold. And we got half our case to go as well. They look really good. Golden graphs. What are the other ones called? Silver sigs? Silver sigs and golden graphs. Don't care, Nick. Not for me. Ian gets all the pirates we're about to pull. And Ian loves the Pirates. Well done. You should watch my video where I break down all the different formats and tell you what the best bang for the buck is. It's a few videos ago. I believe the thumbnail says lots of color. And it's got an artificially generated image on it of a woman in gla with colorful glasses. Speaking of artificially generated images, how funny was that? Did, on the video I played at the beginning of the show, when I was talking about Tim Anderson, I typed in 
sad Tim Anderson just to see what it would come up with. And it, all of them were Tim Anderson playing for the Yankees. Isn't that weird? Here's our hit, Jaron Duran, game used. Stupid AI couldn't tell the difference between the White Sox and the Yankees. Stupid AI. Everybody thinks it's so smart and it's going to take over the world. It's only as smart as the people programming it. You can do it. Come on. There we go. After opening a lot of retail, these hobby boxes seem like a little lackluster. Because every pack in the blaster format had a little something pretty much. Austin Hayes. Here's a gold. We're kind of in it for the silver packs. Oh, sweet. I like that. I like that gold, Bobby. It's a numbered card. It's a great photo. He's one of the best players in the league. Going on the stage. Lucky Peter, what's up? Apologize in advance if I miss anybody's super chat or if I miss anybody's chat. When we get a lot of people in here and I don't activate the members only chat it can it can fly a little quick for me to see everything keep your eyes peeled for the kevin hart cards and the special others all the other special 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 short prints gotta go through it a little bit slower than normal well i'm glad they're all faced the same direction i have not seen any of those jt but I got my eyes peeled now, at least a little bit more than I did before. I'm relying on you guys to catch everything that I miss. But from a parallel standpoint, hobby boxes, at first they were, it was just like, oh, okay, better than last year. We got two rainbow foils and a gold home run challenge card. But after opening retail with the exclusives, retail's popping. Haven't opened any fatties yet. I got a shipment notification that I think my mega boxes or monster boxes are arriving sometime. So we're gonna we're gonna head up Fanatics boxes, and I got a like a case of those, and a case was ten. We got a blue. Come on, big blue. This could be huge. Willie Mays. To 150. It is a standworthy card. A numbered Willie. We'll get a bunch more standworthy cards out of this box. Ripping for rookies is enjoying the Series 1 Monster Boxes. Lucky Peter. What's up? Chris, Fanatics jerseys, awful. I don't know what that means, but... Are, do they have, like, cheap... Like, a cheap jersey or something? What's going on with that? Sorry, I'm trying to catch up with the chat and I'm all, it's all over the place. I'm all over the place. 
Mr. Enfuego, what's happening? I just watched your latest podcast with a league of her own. Wonderful. I'm going to be going on their show sometime. Can't remember the date off the top of my head. Mr. Enfuego probably remembers. You can drop that. Heat press logo, thin pants to where you can see the jersey through the pants. It's not pretty. Jerseys are a hot mess. Fanax dropped the ball on them. Oh boy. Thanks, Noisy Nuggets. Got rid of all the stitching. So they're just going real cheap. That's a bad look. Like their hats that they made, the Fanatics hats that were cheaper than a regular like new era hat. Those things were horrible as well. I bought a Tigers one. I wore it like once and I was like, nope. Cheap, cheap. Justin Henry Malloy, Detroit Tigers Auto. Poor Michael. Volpe, Rookie Refractor. Shea Langoliers, and that is number to 199, a lava parallel. Story Ruiz, Refractor, Wave, Paul Skeens. Gonzalez, Senga. Ariel Castro, Refractor Auto for the Twins. Going to Nathan. Refractor Arius. This is sweet. Masterpieces. Mini Diamond Parallel of Adley. Shellacked. Max Clark Refractor. Jazz. Riley Green. Masterpieces Volpe. Gavin Cross. And Celestin Refractor. A little Riley rookie, Matt McLean, and Brando Maia. Another refractor auto, so two parallel autos so far out of this box. The Yankees hit here. Refractor Nando. Real to real. Cunha. Vaquero Mini Diamond. Number to 299. Cunha Refractor. Jordan Walker and Ryan Clifford. Astros. Going to Brett. Casas Rookie Refractor. Shellacked Churio. Michael Harris Masterpiece. And James Outman Refractor. Make sure I don't got any fingerprints on here. Feels like it was having trouble focusing. We're going to do one more box. It's a jumbo 2024 series one. Then we'll do the second half of the five star box case. And then it'll be perfect time to start break number two. Four of them today, folks. Stick around and strap in. You know, we're going to hit something crazy. They look like jerseys you bought from a dude in the parking lot at the game. Well, Mike Rubin is not one to be embarrassed. So he might have something something to say about it. I could see him just being like, scrap them all, redo it. Just because he doesn't want to be embarrassed. William Contreras. Oh, there's a nice Ellie. Blueprint Ellie. Let's quickly 
Just look for the SPs. I don't know if they'd be in the back like this. I doubt it, but I'm just going to scroll through real quick. It's double stack. Ripping for rookies. Looking forward to see you, seeing you on the Junkies podcast. Yes, that'll be fun. Tigers fan, right? What's your thoughts on Brandon White? I got nothing. Not bad. Gold. Smith Shaver. Not horrible. Rookie. Rookie gold. How about Kyle Tucker and his City Connect? Gold foil glass now. In the middle of the pack. Broken for Phillies, Dodgers, and Yankees. SPs. Has anyone pulled them yet? Yeah, I saw that. It was hilarious, Mr. Enfuego. That was funny. And... Like, I, it had me going up and down because it was a little long. Like, the skit, the, the bit was a little long, but it was funny, and it kept bringing me back and had me laughing. And if I actually laughed by myself, it's a win. And I am judgmental about comedy these days because there's none, really. There's nobody that's that good. Dave Chappelle still gets it done to an extent. But nobody's really willing to take a chance and, and risk it all for a really risky joke. Green. Joey Manessis. Gold foil singer. Yeah, I mean, I knew people are going to start throwing some comedians' names out there, but. Dante Diaz to 199. A little bit rough on the numbering back there. Torkelson, black parallel, chunk of his bat to 199. I like how the bats all have like a unique personality. It all looks a little bit different, different grain, depending on like what kind of bat they're using, what kind of wood they're using and where they're taking the piece from. I think that might be why I prefer bat relics. Freelander, my guy. That's Ellie. Get a few packs of this to go. Four, to be exact. I think 96, Steven. Is 
Zach Gallon. But yeah, if Scooble can hit a hundred, <laughs> watch out. I called it already. If you didn't see my skit, my bit in the beginning, go back, rewind, watch it. What's up, Darren? No, Jeremy. Yep. Big Mitch Hedberg fan. Big Norm McDonald fan. Actually, like, there's a lot of... Uh, Jim Brewer still gets it done. But ever since Norm passed, it's it's got me a little jaded. Because he was the GOAT. Here's a gold. Ooh, gold auto. Justin Martinez. 13 out of 50 for the D-backs going to Al. Gotta love it when your auto's gold. Encroachment. Shohei blueprint. I never, Robin Williams never did it for me. I never thought he was that funny. Like he's funny in movies. I like him better as an actor than a comedian. He's just so all over the place as a comedian that it was hard to, follow maybe i was too young or something i don't know but and maybe his jokes were too mature like when i was young and watching and i just it wasn't getting it or something but i don't know he's just kind of like so all over the place all jacked up it was like a little too much too a little too intense I actually saw Joe Rogan live. He was pretty funny, believe it or not. I mean, he is technically a comedian. It was a good show. Machado, Brian Wu, Cal Ripken Jr., and Yoshida. He came to Detroit when they were doing a UFC thing. Did a couple comedy shows before... The UFC. Justin with a 15 month. Doug Stanhope. Yeah, he's okay. Yeah, everybody's got their own their own flavor that they like. This is pretty nice. This is actually very nice. Noelve Marte rookie. His rookies aren't in the base set yet. So this is going to be collectible for sure to 150. The Reds hit for Joshua. Going to get him up on the stage. We don't got a lot of room. Maybe, maybe like right here. And back to the five star. Four boxes of five star remain. Justin with a 15 month. I appreciate you, brother. Striker's the best. Ben with a $10 dono. Amazing luck on my two monster boxes. Thanks for your value breakdown. Box one, Ellie HFA. Box two, Ellie Rainbow Foil. Corbin Carroll, Independence Day. Rookie Cup. Kim Nero, 89 silver. Henry Davis Green, Alec Thomas Gold. Whoa. Can't wait to open mine. Thanks for the donation. Appreciate that super chat. Oh, Mike Trout, 15 of 20. Wow, that is so sick. It's like a 
a rainbow foil gold oh the border is so cool looking it's so clean man this is a clean trout auto i told you we were gonna get something huge and behind him is a nolan gorman rookie auto wowzers it's a good box this is why you do a case because i mean you can open a if you just buy one box and there's only two cards, hit or miss. But when you get a whole case, you usually get at least one good thing. Are you guys ready? Good thing I bought a case of 180s from Card Shells in preparation. That, my friends, is a snapshot-worthy card. Let's get some more. Marco wonders, how do I know what cards are worth more between gold or blue? Well, you can look it up on eBay. Look up sold listings on eBay. I'll give you a good idea. Whatever's lower numbered usually is better, worth more. The one of ones first printed didn't get the front stamp. You have to look at the back on all the cards. What? No. Ooh, look at this blue. That's a vivid, bright blue. Gabby Moreno, 18 to 25, rookie auto. Going to Al. And Will Clark with his number on there. Nice Giants hit for Brett. Two more to go. <laughs> Independence Day, Will Smith. That would be fun. Oh, sweet. Hall of Famer, Adrian Beltre. 38 of 50. Purple. Going to Texas. Russell. Very cool. And Chris is coming in with 10 gifted. Getting the vibes lifted. Make sure you hit the like button. In honor of Chris's generosity. Byron Buxton. On card auto. He's one of those guys. He is just... He's just a complete season away from being an all-star. I guess you don't have to play a complete season to be an all-star. He's a complete first half away from being an all-star. He could, like... Do I talk about Buxton too much? I don't know, but he could, he could be, like, an MVP. He's got the skill set. This feels like an awfully thick pack right here. We got something in this pack, I think. Some kind of case hit or something, maybe. Something in this pack that is thick, I think. Oh, yes. Bo Jackson Auto. It's a free hit. It's a freebie. That's what we got. We got a bonus hit. Dude, that is awesome. Bo Jackson with his socks uniform. Oh, ho, ho. Eric. Oh, I'm jealous. I don't usually get jealous, but I like a bow. Here it is. Jazz Chisholm, five tool phenom. That's got to be some kind of case hit. Six of 25. Marlins getting involved. Going to William. Is that our freebie hit? Wow. And on the back, Kyle Stowers. Going to Sky. Congratulations, Sky. All right, you guys want to look at the hits? That's the last box of break number one. We're doing four of them. Plenty more to go. 
and we're just sliding right into the breaks with no delay. We're going to look at the hits, start opening more boxes for break number two, just like that. Let's look at all these bad dogs first. I kind of like five star. I like the flow of it. Hall of Famers, rookies, and stars, pretty much. Up and coming talent. Separate these just a little bit. Just a tick. Okay. Here it is. The hits from break number one. Yandy Diaz. That's a red to 199. Manessis. Green to 499. Vaquero mini diamond parallel to 299. Langoliers lava to 199. Adley masterpieces mini diamond unnumbered, but that is his rookie. Game used Jaron Duran, Spencer Torkelson major league material to 199. Nuelve Marte silver pack blue numbered to 150. Kyle Tucker. Game used, City Connect. Got a gold Bobby there. Willie Mays to 150. Ryan Clifford, base auto. Malloy, Maya refractor auto. Castro, refractor. Justin Martinez, rookie auto, gold. 13 of 50. Nolan Gorman auto, five star. Rookie auto. Bo Jackson. Let's go. That is sweet. I might I might open a case of this for my PC. I don't know. It, I kind of like it. 6 to 25, Jazz. 5 tool phenom. Kyle Stowers, rookie auto. Trevor Hoffman, silver sign signatures. 18 of 25, Carlton Fisk, golden graphs. 2 of 40. Gabby Moreno, 18 of 25, rookie auto. JJ Blade, rookie auto. Barry Larkin, 9 of 75. C.J. Abrams, Nick Prado, rookie auto. Adrian Beltre, 38 of 50. Nice purple parallel. Byron Buxton, base. Tristan Casas, rookie auto. Logan O'Hoppy, 15 of 75. Aqua, rookie. Will Clark. And the Hot B. Hit of the break, Mike Trout, 15 to 20. On card glory. Break number two begins. Welcome. If you're here for break number two, you found the right place. We will start, we'll start with a little stack, a little half stack, a five star. We doing okay? I don't want to go too, uh, just too crazy, too quick with, with it. Make sure everybody's on board. Would you say Bo in a Sox Uni is more collectible? I don't know. Probably not. But I don't think it's more or less collectible. 
probably more people that want him in a Royals. But I don't know. Jeff with a 35-month member chat. Five more months until I'm a legend. Love the breaks. You're already a legend, and you know it. Shalaney, nice to see you. You think pineapple is good on pizza? No. Wow, another Beltre. And that is even lower numbered. Are the Beltres going to be flowing out of here? 14 out of 15. Make sure I got the right break up. Yes, I do. Break number two. Who's got Texas? John does. Woo. And Blade. Was that the same collation as the last one? I don't know. Mr. Enfuego with a two dollar. Keep doing big things. See you March 2nd, brother. March 2nd. Indeed. Appreciate the super chat. Keep doing your thing too. I love it. I love baseball card content. Especially like like how you guys are doing it with talking about all the new stuff. New releases. Interesting news. Opinions. And I like how you guys kind of switch it over, like go, you know, go over to your channel for a little looser vibe. TJ Kid, you kind of, it's kind of an oxymoron. It says the price point point for every product makes it impossible to make any profit, and then says sad day for collecting. Well, what is it? Are you collecting or are you trying to make a profit? Those are two different things, my friend. Paul Molitor, ten of forty. And our boy, Alec Manoa. These silver cigs. I like them. Manoa. You know what I'm going to do this year? I think I might get in on some cheap Manoa in drafts. I'm going to keep my, my eyes peeled on the box scores and the news. And he lost a bunch of weight. I... I like I like hearing that and I hope that everybody sleeps on them and that I can get them for like a buck or something in the drafts. A lot of wanders on the floor that missed the trash can. <sighs> it's pretty good, Craig. I mean, it's uh, let's get a sample size established. By the time there's four cases done, I'll be able to tell you, but decent names are coming out of here. Hall of Famers, rookies, and stars, and Manoa. Oh, look at this. Whoa. Pentamorous penmanship. Two of 15. Alec Thomas. A clear acetate shadow box. That's cool. And another Will Clark. 
We got a lot of Will Clarks coming out of here. If you have the Giants, congratulations on the Will Clark Auto, both now and in the future. Kevin, you get that one. And D backs, Anthony. Well, Leaf does have some cool things. The only thing going against it is uh, the licensing, really, the lack of licensing. But they've got a lot of cool multiplayer cards that have both autographs and relics and stuff on them. It's not for me, but I wouldn't be opposed to opening it. I'm just kind of a snob about licensing. Last pack from the half stack. And it's a Volpe Rookie Auto Purple Parallel 26 of 50. Going to the Yankees, Justin. Congratulations, Justin. What's after him? Wesneski. Cubs. For Cole. Good thing I got my thick sleeves. Intermission featuring Series 1. Five-star intermission. Uh, yeah, I saw one of those dudes went to Leaf. I watched, I watched part of that video, most of it. One of those dudes. Can't remember his name. One of those popular football rippers. I'm waiting to see somebody put his name in the chat. You got the sickest gunner patch in Leaf. It's definitely a, an affordable way to rip. An affordable way to chase. Dude, let's go. Card collector two. Yep, that was it. Thanks, Bowie. If you're not a fan of Volpe's new signature, you prefer his Topps Chrome full signature? Yeah. It, his Topps Chrome one's definitely better. I got a Tops Now auto of his, and it was full. And I sent it off to the upgrade shop, I think. Scary sound. I know. It's just on a, like a playlist. It just keeps going down and for also freezing up. And I'm going to have to find a new company to get some music from because I can't tolerate it. Here we go, through the base. Travel with me through the base cards. A boring trip with all the other breakers, but with me, 
the best time of your life. Yeah! Rainbow foil. We're still digging, diving, swimming through the mud, looking for this card right here. This one is flipped around, looking for it all day. Found it. Curtis Mead Auto. Out of a hobby box. That's a win. For the Tampa Bay Rays. Wouldn't you know. David, congratulations. You got some bands that would let you use their tunes? Do you? Just have them send me an email or something. Let's work it out. Ellie. But see this thing that I use, it's got uh, like thousands and thousands of songs in all different genres and it's all, it just, it's really handy. Why is that shameful? I mean, it's. Just relax, Tyler. Not every team has cards in every release. I hate to break it to you. O'Neill Cruz Black. He says, shame on top. There are other things you could shame them for that are much more shameable. If you wanted to cast shame on tops, you're going to be casting shame for quite some time, but not because of that necessarily. You can add that to your list if you want, but. You better get out your legal pad. So you got plenty of room to write down all the shame. What did we even, okay, so we got an auto. We got a couple of rainbows. I guess that's our numbered card. And maybe something out of this pack, I don't know. Maybe something good out of here. Is Curtis Mead hype force or good? He's good. He's not, he's not even in the realm of hype force. Brian Wu, Cal Ripken Jr., and Yoshida Cup in the Silvers. If you like Tampa Bay Rays, Bowman's best. Yeah, Avery. Fanatics box video, hopefully coming tomorrow. I hate to like promise something and not deliver. So I'll just say hopefully coming tomorrow, but it's coming as soon as possible. I'm, I'm trying to do way too many things at once and just like, oh, there's so much going on. It's crazy. It's crazy, which reminds me, 
it's a good time to apologize to anybody who's emailing me, expecting a response. <laughs> Lot, lots and lots of emails coming through every day. Not going to be able to get to them all. Sorry. I'll try, though. But that's another reason to become a slammer. At least I, I will prioritize slammers' messages and get to those before the other ones. Let me drop you a link if you want to get involved in the breaks. This is how you do it. Patreon. It's a way to connect content creators with their fans. It's got like a messaging system where you can direct message me. I can post videos and links and images. And if you download the Patreon app on your phone, you'll get notifications that pop up right to your phone which is if you're in the group and you're looking to get in on a break, make sure you download the app. You'll get an email and a notification on your phone. But the breaks sell out really fast, so you gotta act quick. And having that app on your phone is the way to go. Have you recovered from your weird, well, wait till you see, wait till you see the next video. That's all I'm going to say. James Outman. Nice auto. Rookie auto for the Dodgers. Going to Nick. Volpe Refractor rookie. Max Clark Refractor. Celestin. Two good autos already. I'm going to Terry. We got an Arius Refractor. We got a Corbin Carroll sitting in a giant glove. Julio Rodriguez, purple parallel. This one's numbered to 250. Another one for Terry. Story Ruiz refractor. Wave Vaquero. Zales, Casas, Wood, Montez. Mini box number two. Yeah, it is a fine looking auto sitting there. Getting into it. Brett Beatty refractor. Riley Green, McLean, Alonzo, Blue Max Clark. Love it. Number to 150. For Scott. Cunha Refractor. Ooh, gold. Yuri Perez, rookie. I like that. 62 of 75. Gold Lava. All right. What? I wonder why the old camera's having so much trouble focusing today. It's looking at too much back there. That's the problem. Stop looking back there. Focus right here. There's Junior. Outman. Refractor. Got a couple cards to top load real quick. If you're in break three or four, run in a few minutes behind. I didn't know how long they'd take. We're going to be doing some more five star on Friday. And we're going to up our game a little bit. I did them this way to kind of determine and see how many hits there are like per team figure out what teams are getting the hits and try to incorporate some other teams into the mix. It's a learning experience. And then Friday, we're gonna up the ante a little bit and get in, 
get into some higher dollar ones. Maybe add a little sapphire. I don't know. Wait, wait, wait. Not so fast. Jumbo. Still. Then the second half. Yeah, Yuri Perez is awesome. Mauricio, yeah, um, big prospect. Michaelis. Gold Michaelis, Rainbow Foil Musgrove, Ken Griffey Jr. And then some other cards here. Keep your eyes peeled for the good, good. Phillies, Yankees, Dodgers. Looking for our SPs. Dimitri, doing great. Mostly random Dustin. It's people like it better that way. Because when you got to pay for your teams, you're going to pay a lot for the good teams. And then all the rest of the teams are going to sit there and nobody's going to want them. O'Neal Cruz. Player worn. You want to know why? He didn't play a whole lot of games. O'Neal Cruz. Last year, right? He just... I'm going to... I'm going to go with that is why. Okay, Phillies. No little five foot two Kevin. I'm glad Kevin Hart's a good sport about his height. I've known some little fellas that aren't so, they're not such a good sport about when you make fun of their height. They get real angry. Start kicking you in the ankles. Not fun. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Cruz is a big fantasy sleeper this year because he's got the potential to do things offensively that people going much earlier in fantasy drafts can do. Two cruises, and we got some pirates up. Hey, I'll take an O'Neill cruise. It's not, you know, I, I got nothing against him. I like, I'll take O'Neill cruises all day long. Preferably rookies, but you know, relics and parallels are good too. Autos, game used Garrett Cole, Campusano, rainbow foil. Norton with a 22 month. Go through your base. Find any SSPs? No. Have not found any SSPs. They must be super short printed. No, don't freeze. Oh, you suck. Oh, looks like I'm gonna have to clear my cash out or something. Is that what I'm gonna have to do? 
I don't want to. I, I don't want to. You know what we could do just as a temporary? I, I could find a different. I'm going to. I'm going to find a different one. I think this is free. Hopefully it's free. I might get popped for this, but hey. It's not going to be as good. I want it just barely audible in the background. Emmett's in the house. Where is he? Hey, there he is. I made you a mod, Emmett. Hope you don't mind. All it means is that now you have infinite power. Use it wisely. With great power, something, something, something. All right. Back to the grind. Zach Wheeler. I don't know if you saw this, Emmett, but I got your gold sapphire. It's a pretty sick card. All right, we're going to do three hours of cyberpunk industrial. Get down. Get down and dirty. Colton Cows or Rainbow Foil. It's a rookie in a parallel. And I'm going to top load him. Put him off to the side, though. Not enough room on the stage. Let's all agree the Padres need less cards in this set. No. No. If we're talking about teams that need less cards in the set. Number one. Pirates. Less cards in the set. Connor Phillips auto. Number two. Let's see if we got any of them on the stage. Of course we don't. Why would we? But number two, I'll, sh I'll show you when we get there. It'll be happening soon. See? Giants. Less cards in the set, please. Although I do like Luis Matos and Luciano. We could keep those two and let the less and, and let the rest of them dance off the stage. Dimitri asks, besides Ellie, who's your favorite rookie this year? See, this is, I, I've said this before, but just how my eyes work is if you got a green or a blue highlight, like I'll see your chat. That's another reason to spend the $1.99 and support your old pal Striker. So you get a green highlight. So I actually see your messages. Otherwise, my eyes won't even look at them. Just because I'm like, just, I have one second. Less than a second to just scan and like zone in on the first thing I see. Plenty of pirates. Not enough Padres. Well, that was a jumbo box. And we're left with two silver packs.
Jeff, with a question for Emmett. If you made it to the bigs this season, who is the batter you'd least like to face from the mound? Ooh. That's a good question, Jeff. That's a great question. Start time. Ching ching. Six hundred fifty-five in the house. We got to get those likes up just a little bit. Come on, crew. Two fifty-seven. We can do better. Chris is wondering with his twenty-month membership. Hey, Strike, are you planning on going to the national? I'm, I still don't. I don't know. Someone else has got to organize it. I don't feel like organizing anything. But I am going to opening day. And that's going to be a blast. Which, anybody that's going to the Detroit Tigers opening day game, maybe just send me a little message. Let me know. Maybe, maybe, maybe we can say hi. Have a $15 drink together. Drew Waters. And Big Poppy, Golden Graffs, Drew Waters, Rookie Auto, and Hall of Famer Sig. Tigers opening day facing the Oakland Athletics. Currently the Oakland Athletics. Soon to be the Salt Lake City Athletics? Another box. Couch fam. Love to hear it. Yeah, if you're a, a mod and a member, the green or the blue wrench takes precedent over the green member name. So you'll be blue if you're both rather than green. I don't know, it's just how it works. Austin Riley, young thick. And Michael Toglia to 75. Aqua. We got a Rocky. We got a Brave. Jake's got the young thick. And Brett. As Michael Toglia. We're getting a little cramped up here. Only two boxes to go. Then on to break number three. Jenks. Hey, yo. Look at this. Jorge Posada. 20 of 20. Blue. Silver Sigs. And Byron Buxton. Byron Buxton hit number two of the day. Jorge Posada. First time we've seen him on the stage in a while. But there's a lot of Posada fans.
Not a knob. A golden graph. But I like them. They look good. Man, we got some room over here now. Yeah, that's a little better. Here's our thicky. The last box again. Is that a triple hit? And the thick one. Are we going to get a case hit sandwiched in, the, in between? Ooh, I like that. Riley Green. Rookie auto, 7 of 75. Aqua for the Tigers. Going to Scott. Very nice. Let's look at the back one, and then we'll look at the middle one, just in case it's a really special one. Nick Prado, rookie auto. And purple Nolan Gorman, 43 of 50. I like these three hitters. I'm glad they did that once again. Seems like we're getting those little bonus hits from a lot of the fanatic stuff this year, or well, 2023 stuff especially. We only have one example this year, and I, I don't think I've seen any bonus hits come out of series one. You guys have have you guys seen any? Like extra auto, extra relic, some kind of super duper. Oh, that's it for this break. Let's check out the hits real quick. Then we'll do it all again. Two more times. By the time it's all said and done, we're going to have four full rips, full case rips. Of five star. So far, so good. I think. Not seeing a lot of pitcher autos. Not a lot of pitcher autos out of here. Very few. And quite a few nice Hall of Fame SIGs. The Beltres. They're flowing. Going to have to judge and see what we like better. I know I already asked you guys a little while ago what you like better, tier one or five star. After these cases are done, I'll be able to tell you. You're getting two autos in both of them, basically. You're just getting a, you're getting a relic out of tier one. All right, let's check it out. Beltre, 14 of 15. A little green. JJ Bladé, rookie auto. Paul Molitor, 10 of 40, Silver Sigs. Will Clark, Alec Manoa, Wisniewski. That's cool. Pentamerous Penmanship, 2 of 15. Cover that up, can you see? Anthony Volpe, 26 out of 50. Jorge Posada. To 20. Got a Connor Phillips. Julio to 250. Yuri Perez to a 75 rookie auto. O'Neill Cruz to 299. Curtis Mead rookie auto. Big Poppy. Byron Buxton. Garrett Cole. It's game used. Pinstripe. Cy Young. Celestin base auto. Max Clark blue. O'Neill Cruz player worn. James Altman, rookie auto. Drew Waters to 20. Austin Riley. Toglia to 75. Gorman, purple to 50. Riley Green to 75. Both rookie autos. And Nick Prado. Break number three. Let's get it.
feel like these five star boxes are messing with the camera for some reason. Let's push them all the way back. What did we start with? Oh yeah, we started with four of these. Prepping. Five stars fire says Mark. Pulled a gold Miggy the other day. Nice color match. Philip says 100% five star. It's it's feeling, I mean, it is more expensive. It's a little more expensive. And you would think like on the surface, you're like one less card for, for tier one. You get one more card and it's less money. So, uh, I think instinctively it's like, well, that's probably better. You still get two autos in both of them. You just get an additional card. These are higher quality, lower numbered autos coming out of here. And you don't have the relic. And the relic isn't that big of a deal anyway. But tier one's good. It had those bonus hits in there too. A lot of boxes, like every third box had a bonus hit. So, Yeah, I do have a quick growing beard, Robert, but I can't wait to get rid of it. As soon as the sun comes out, I'm just like, time to get rid of the beard. Ooh. Ooh, 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 another pentamerous penmanship. This time, it's Xander Bogarts. And that is 7 of 10 green parallel. Let's pull up the correct spreadsheet, Striker, so you're not saying the wrong names again. Padres, Dennis, congratulations. And a Vaughn Grissom rookie auto. Nice box number one. Indeed. This one's a little bit thinner, the pentamerous. It may go into a 130. Let me see. Just curious. We got a special U. Oh, yes, it does. It fits into a 130. Special UV coated one. Premium. Come on, camera. Snap out of it. Yeah, we need a cut auto. You think we'll get one out of four cases? Oh, look at that bad boy. Julio Silver Signatures. That is sweet. Hector. That is numbered 36 of 40. Yes. And Logan O'Hoppy. Julio, according to fantasy, like from a fantasy standpoint, he's the number two player. It's like Acuna, then Julio, then Bobby. They're kind of the one, two, three. Now, it depends on what format you're playing. I guess a little bit like it may be slightly different depending on what kind of format your league is, but Logan O'Hoppy going to Brett Julio going to Hector. Let's uh, I'm not gonna should I uh, is that the hot B already? I don't know. Do we get crazy? Speed plus power, and he hits for a respectable average. Not going to hurt you there. Juicy OPS. That is a thick boy right here. Oh, yeah. We got our bonus. Bonus hit coming right away. Luis Robert. White Sox auto for Jeremy. Let's 
go this way. Will Benson. Another Cincy. That's his rookie autograph. For Edgar. And Christopher Morrell, rookie auto. 45 of 75. Pretty good box. It's almost like with five star, like the checklist is quite good. Like when you get a guy. So if you get an autograph, let's say out of a, a flagship or even Bowman or Bowman draft or something like that. If you don't get the best guy, there's, you know, there's a, there's a tier one at a tier S tier. There's like an S tier of like two guys, sometimes maybe three or something, but sometimes one, it just depends. And then it drops off from there into like an abyss. Whereas there's so many, so few pitchers and so many batters in here and so many stars that even if you don't get, I don't even know, like this, there's just like a really loaded S tier and A tier. There's like a huge A tier, big S tier, huge A tier, and then a good size B tier. And there's just a few players that you might not want. Like Will Benson. Okay, he might not be the biggest name, but he's actually pretty good. Puts up some pretty good numbers. And it's a batter's rookie auto that has upside at least. That already made the league and is on a good team in a good hitting environment. Seven hundred in here. Hit the like. Christian Yelich. See what I mean? It's like <laughs> if you don't get like a big rookie auto. Here you go, Christian Yelich, former MVP, six of seventy-five, and it's a parallel, and he's got a nice sig, and it's a good thick quality card. Max Freed. I'm liking five star. Just talking it out live, learning live with you. What's it all about? How good is it? Pretty good. Pretty good. How do you join the breaks? Asks Brant. Let me drop you a link. Got to join the Patreon group. If you like the channel and you like me and you want to support me, join the Patreon group. Get notified when I post a break. Buy in if you want. Hobby. Series one. Yeah, I, I, I like Will Benson. Their team is so loaded. They've got they've got like all-star level talent or uh, like maybe not quite all-star, but just really young, um, multi-tool talented players on that roster that they're looking for places to play them. That's why I was kind of joking, but not really. With Jonathan India, it's like, dude was their best player not two years ago. And now he's like, is he going to... He's kind of had some nagging injuries. It's like, is he even going to be able to play on that team on a regular basis? Or is he, is he going to be relegated to like a platoon type of role? Do they trade him for... Because he's got, I would imagine... If he can get healthy and he's got some good, really good trade return, like you'd get a pretty good return. I don't know what, but if they need another pitcher, which can always use another pitcher, but they got a good young staff too. <laughs> India's turning into a washed old man. It's like two years out of his rookie season, three years. I'm going to be watching a lot of Reds this year. Every day, probably. I'm probably going to watch more Reds than Tigers. Because I'm going to be playing a lot of DFS baseball. And I'm going to be stacking some Reds, especially when they're at home. Here's my strategy. Reds at home all day long. Reds on the road. Not so much. And it's not because they're not going to do well on the road or anything like that. It's because they're going to put up ridiculous numbers at home. 
and people don't associate that ballpark like like they do Coors. It's basically like Coors, and then all the other ballparks are they don't stand out in a, a normie's mind as like the the place you got to stack. So when they put up like 10, 10 run games at home, then they're going to go on the road and people's mindset DFS players are going to be like ones that don't, that maybe aren't so deep into it are just going to be like, Oh, red stack them up. I know they're in Pittsburgh, but who cares? So that's when I'm going to fade them. And I'm going to play the Pirates. I'm already really excited. Josh Young. Major League material. For the Rangers. Going to Eric. Already formulating DFS strategy. It's all, it's all fine to formulate this in advance but there's way too many factors to say exactly what you're going to do no five five foot two kevin hard on that one I think Kevin Hart should come into the stream and hang out. I think he'd have a good time. We're chasing his card. Someone text him real quick. Tell him we're chasing his cards. Maybe he'll come and hang. Every Philly, should I give it a look? Of course, we don't get any more. Happy birthday, Kitchen Chris. Blue parallel. Yastrzemski. Look at all these hits coming. Vientos. Rainbow and a gold. And it's got a red border. Could it be? Oh. Oh, no. Oh. 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 Never fails. Start talking about a guy. He shows up at the party. Jumbo. Couple of silvers. Ten fat jumbo pack. They don't like to be. Ten big boned packs. The kid, Rainbow Jimenez. I kind of, I'm going to go a little quicker through these because I'm kind of getting annoyed having to go through every single base card. Especially when I don't know for sure if they're even going to be in the middle of the pack or if they're just going to be sprinkled wherever. Nobody's given me a solid answer on that. Jose Ramirez, game used bat relic for the Guardians. That's one guy I never really, I never get Jose Ramirez on my team, on my fantasy team. I don't know why. It's not that I don't want him. I think it's that I don't want to spend the money required to get him. 
Because he's not in like the greatest hitter park and he doesn't have the greatest team around him. But man, he's so consistently awesome. Jeremy. Usually what I do is I spend all my money in an auction draft on superstars. And then I sit there for like two hours and don't draft anybody until the very end. Studs and scrubs. Because I know so many of the like lower tier players that I feel very comfortable being able to like nickel and dime my way to a solid team. And the good players are just so good that you got to have a couple of them. They just do so many things. And home runs are not easy to come by. Like I like I don't like spending all my money on steals. I like spending it on home runs if possible. And RBIs are like you would think, eh, I got a home run hitter. I'm going to get a lot of, a lot of RBIs. What is this? It's a golden mirror. I thought it was something crazy. That's funny. Victor Medeiros. Medeiros. Taking a bite out of the apple. What a sweet card. Brett, congratulations. We got a golden mirror. And even better, a gold Ryan O'Hearn. And even better yet, gold foil tray cabbage. We're getting them all, guys. We're getting every good card that we could possibly imagine. Next up. Kevin Hart parallel. Bound to get one. Adley is rated higher than Tatis on MLB rank, please. Tatis is going to, like, I, I'm so glad. Like, he's he's not flying under the radar, like, big time. But he is a little bit. If hearing that, that's ridiculous. Adley's great, and I want Adley. I'm like, there's so many guys I want. But normally I don't draft a catcher. I I get a dollar catcher. Because I, there's, it's a catcher. But this year, I'm going to try to get Adley. Switch up the strategy a little bit because I've been, like the last couple of years, I've just been destroyed. Look at this. We got an Ellie Rainbow Foil Parallel. Things are going well. For Edgar. Edgar, you're crushing it. You got a Will Benson Auto. You got an Ellie Rainbow Foil. Mm-hmm. Back to the catcher talk. Everybody wants to hear all about the catchers. There's another Ellie. But I picked up Henry Davis last year, and I was thinking, ha ha. I am the smartest boy in the room. Picked him up off the waivers. Didn't work out for me. Picked up Alvarez and thought, ha ha. Smartest boy again. Didn't didn't quite work out for me. Dropped him. Dropped Henry. And then finally, one final ha ha. And it, I, I, this is so hard talking and going through all this, holding the conversation. The final ha ha was Patrick Bailey. And he wasn't that good either. So it's three kind of like just guys that weren't getting me anything out of the spot. And they're three highly touted, like big prospect catchers. Now this year, they're all three of them are probably going to have huge seasons. And I'm going to be grinding my teeth when I, 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 you know, I draft like a good catcher. Finally, gold foil. Be like, of course, this is the year. Henry Davis breaks out. Patrick Bailey has a good season. Alvarez turns into a boss.
Yahoo Public Leagues. I don't like Yahoo Baseball. I used to be in a Yahoo Baseball League for many, many years, but I prefer ESPN. Connor Joe, another world famous pirate. Formerly Rockies. Surprisingly, his stats were better at Coors, I think. All good, Chris. You're here, and you know what? We got it set up like a little DVR. Andy Rodriguez. Pirates. Let's go, Pirates. Jack and Thomas. I knew I'd get you one. An auto, Andy Rodriguez. I knew I'd get you a good one. I got to make sure my three-hour cyberpunk doesn't wear off and then go right to copyrighted music. Senga gold foil. Looks good with the gold cup on there. Nicholas says, Strikers, the Otani are breaking. I appreciate that. Although, I'm way better than Otani at breaking. And currently, I think I might be a better pitcher. We got three silver packs. At least until, until he's healed up. You know what I'm saying? I don't think he can pitch right now. I, 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 if you get the gun out, you know, we're talking, I don't know, high 40s? <laughs> 50? I don't know. I have no clue. Last time I had the gun out, it was like at a Tigers game where they just have it set up, you know, and you can go up there and give it all you got. The machine didn't even register it. It's just like, eh. Let the little kid throw that's waiting behind you. Give me one more. I can do this. How about some silver packs? We saved them. Mm, Tyler, you got a lot of juice. Dude, I have so many keepers on my team this year. It's crazy. Today, our commish officially reactivated the league. And I've been waiting. I've been checking and waiting and waiting and checking. And my keeper situation is prime. It's so prime. It's unbelievable. The options. Curtis Mead, Ken Griffey Jr., Trey Turner. Are we going to get a parallel or an auto? My fantasy baseball team had the greatest name. I thought long and hard about it. Switched back and forth from clever name to more clever name. And then I decided to go meta. I named it Fantasy Baseball Team. Fantasy Baseball Team. There's Ellie. Went real meta. And I named my basketball team Fantasy Basketball Team. I'm just so sick of having the best name and not letting anybody else even have a decent name compared to, there he is. We got Ellie. It's a success. One more box of glorious other hits than five star. So here's my keepers. I could keep the following players for free. 
Patrick Bailey, Nolan Jones, Julio. I still have Julio. He was a buck. And Bobby is a, was 11 bucks. Chaz McCormick, free. Christopher Morrell, free. Ellie De La Cruz, free. Julian, free. Sal Freelich, free. Matt McLean, free. Tristan Casas, free. Riding that waiver wire. Like it's my favorite horse. So you're like, wow, you got all those guys for free? Who are your, who are the guys you paid for? Jordan for 55 bucks. Devers for 43. I told you, studs and scrubs. I don't know what happened to the rest of my. <laughs> and then it was like Zach Wheeler. I don't know who else I spent money on. I must have dropped a lot of guys that were in that like 10 to $15 range. We got an autograph on the reel to reel. Lazardo Montez. Lazaro. That's two of 25 mini diamond parallel. And I finished the year in second place. I was in the championship game. And it came down to the very last game of the year for all the marbles. And that was right around the time that Ellie and McLean were going through their rookie slumps. Him. Nice Corbin him. That's a tough pull. And there's a, actually a bounty on that auto, that Corbin Carroll him autograph. I think it's a $10,000 cash and 10000 in Fanatics credit or something like that. Does anybody know about that? McLean wave. Nice McLean rookie. Mike Trout, numbered Trout. The 299. Tommy Troy refractor. Basalo. I'm always looking like, for some reason, Basalo. I keep thinking that this is like a, a guy we need to look out for. Basalo Auto. So, yeah, I had Wheeler. And oh, I got Freddie Peralta for 12 bucks, and he ended up crushing for that price. And I also have Kode Senga for 3 bucks. He destroyed that price, too. So my team was pretty awesome. And Mitch Keller I got for free. Like, he had... It was like a tale of two seasons with Mitch Keller. I'd like to have Harper on my team. There's too many. The thing of it is, is there's like, when you have keepers like this, we have two keepers in our league. So I'm keeping Ellie for free and I'm keeping Julio. I, I paid a buck for him, but there's like some kind of an increase in price. He might be like 11 bucks. He's like a 40 something dollar player. So it's good value. But when everybody has two keepers, Encarnacion, the, the top tier players end up drying up really quick. So you got to overpay. For like the remaining superstar elites. And it dries up so fast. That's why I, like I gotta get two superstars. Like I'm gonna spend a hundred bucks. Maybe more. I might try to get three. I don't know. Pete to 50. That's a cool card. Real to real. Lava. Tucker Toman. Auto. Yoshida Refractor. McLean Refractor. And Riley Green Refractor.
A lot of hits. A couple of nice parallel McLean rookies out of that box. We got the Wave and the Refractor. Yeah, Basalo. Yeah, he he's a guy we need to keep our eyes on. Problem is he plays catcher and that position he's blocked. But, but maybe he'll be like a first baseman or a DH. I don't know if Mount Castle is long for that team. So if they got another like first base slot that might open up. We're going to stack these up. I, I, just like so. There we go. Time for the five-star boxes, the remaining five-star boxes incoming. Let's pull them up here and make yourself some more room back here. There. There. Bang, 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 bang. Bang, bang, bang. Time! The rest of the case. Great to hear, Amanda. Bring MLB to Utah, says Nick, with a four ninety nine. We're starving for it. Our biggest claim to fame is Mike Trout, our Mike Trout statue at our AAA ballpark, Salt Lake Bees. They are thirsty for a big league team, and Oakland is not. So get them out and get them in. Molitor, 18 of 50. Peguero, base auto. Pick up the pace just a little bit here. Sleeve them all up, top load them in just a minute. Jackson Merrill, yeah, that's one thing that they're lacking. Padres is the the outfield situation is kind of in flux. Uh, if that's even the right word, it's just not a lot of. I guess it's going to be Profar, Tatis, and Merrill? Question mark. Look at this big boy. Jeremy Pena with a thick sig, 13 of 50. Golden graphs going to the Astros, Robert. We got Peraza, rookie auto for the Yanks. Going to Brett. How's the trash pile looking? Under control. Mm. Yeah, it's probably a little from column A, a little from column B, Rice. But yeah, probably has a lot to do with ownership, if not a vast majority. Josh Young, rookie auto for Nick. And Silver Sigs Beatty. These cards are cool. 12 of 15, all on card autos. All thick, good card stock. That one's going to Ian, and we got one box left. Any raccoons move in yet? We probably got several families of them living in there. But the craziest thing I've ever seen, one of the craziest things was driving home from my friend's house one night. He was having a little get together a few towns over. And it was like 3 a.m. Designated driver driving home. And we saw hundreds of raccoons on the road live. All of them alive. Families of them. It was wild. Casas Rookie Auto. And Walker Bueller, 23 of 50 purple. We're going to see Walker this year. I think they're going to take it easy on him, but we're going to see him.
If anybody's late arriving to the show, rewind it to the beginning sometime or watch it after we're done. And let me know what you think about my little my little sketch, whatever. I don't know what to call it. Segment. We call it a segment. That's it. Let's look at the hits. Because it took some time. We got our three hitter out of the way real early. In this case. Okay, here they are. The hits. Oh, Hoppy Auto. Grissom. Both rookie autos. Xander Bogart, seven of ten. Pentanimous penmanship. Tucker Toman. Pete Alonzo Lava. Number to 50. Christian Yelich to 75, Christopher Morell to 75, Josh Young, Major League Materials, Max Fried, Luis Robert, Will Benson, Rookie Auto, Encarnacion, Basalo, Mike Trout, Mini Diamond, numbered to 299, Medros, and that is a golden mirror. Why are you do acting a fool, camera? Jose Ramirez, game used bat. Mount Castle. Relic. Ellie. Rainbow Foil. Rodriguez. Rookie Auto. Corbin Carroll, him. Montez to 25, mini diamond parallel. Ellie, Silver Pack Mojo. Casas, Rookie Auto. Peralta. Jeremy Pena, Golden Graphs. 13 of 15. Paul Molitor, 18 of 50. Purple. Piguero, rookie auto. Bueller, purple to 50. Beatty, silver sigs, 12 of 15. Josh Young, rookie auto. Ant, the hot B, silver signatures, 36 out of 40. Julio. Break number four begins. Ready? Five star. Break number four. Hundred and eighty point, brother. Epic. Thanks, mailman. Bobby! Six of fifty. Purple auto. I love Bobby Sig too. Like, it's not too fancy, but I just, I like it. And Walker Bueller. Another Walker Bueller. So Justin's got the Bobby. And Sky's got the Bueller. Five star is basically Inception, isn't it? No, not even close. Not even similar, really. Inception, one auto, and a bunch of base cards. This, two autos, all on card. Inception has some sticker autos. 
Oh, ho, 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 look at this. Matt Chapman, look at that chunker. Six of 15. Green parallel with an enormous game used piece of memorabilia patch. Going to the Blue Jays, Eric. That is a gnarly hit. I could like feel it through the package. And Javier Assad. Holy moly. That is crazy. Nice, John. Good luck, Jonathan. Got the Guardians. Yeah, that's the first patch. Another Julio. This one's green. Silver 6 to 15. Whoa. David. Wow, that is hot. And CJ Abrams for Nathan. Five stars fun, I got to admit. I'm liking it a lot. More on Friday. If any slammers couldn't get in on these breaks and they want an early notification for the next break, just DM me. Send me a little DM just requesting an early notification. It's not a big deal. I can do it easily. But it's got to be DM through Patreon. And our thick boy. We got a bonus hit in this one, guys. Bo Jackson on top, and we get a bonus hit, too. Bo going to John. Ivan Herrera. Cardinals for Clay. And it's going to be something numbered in between. Jordan Gross hands, 3 of 15. I don't think he has a team. I'm pretty sure he got waived, but he, this is a Miami hit. Thomas, congratulations. Get those on the stage in just a minute. Let us enjoy... A different kind of music. This is at least a different song. There. New video, hopefully coming out tomorrow. Fanatics boxes. Are they good? Are they bad? Is the pirate's curse upon me forever? Or did I destroy the curse and replace it with something far, far better? Or is a different curse upon me? Tune in tomorrow to find out. Oh, they picked up. Okay. I thought I saw some news about him not having a team, but. Do you have any monster hits with Definitive this year? Yeah. You should go back and watch the vids. No auto in your jumbo. You can get a go to tops.com, Justin. File a claim for a missing hit. Just make sure you keep like the box. They might need like a number out of there or, or some kind of a proof of purchase. Maybe that's why nobody's finding them, Zane. Oh, Box Bear, you can check that out at whatismycardworth.com. 
Here we go. We're going to move a little bit quicker through this. Just a little. Just until we get to JJ Blade Rainbow Foil. And we pick that pace up again. And we go zooming, making sure to double check the Phillies. Henry Davis Relic. Well, I'll be. I'll be horn swoggled. I pulled a Henry Davis card of note. But not for me. For William. Any more Phillies in here? Wow, man, that first little stack of five stars, pretty crazy. Julio and Bobby Autos, whoo. We got a gold coming up right here. Behind Yuri Perez. Ooh, that looks good. I think that's the first Marlins team border I've seen. That looks awesome. Thomas. Yeah. And a gold. Take that. Take that, won't we, Phil? Second year, rookie cup, gold, Corbin Carroll. Mm-hmm. Put him off the side in his own special pile. Oh, what is it? Oh, I thought that was a vintage stock. No. Just a Mets team card rainbow foil. Nice alley. Silver pack. Let's save the silver. Let's save the silver like we did last time. We'll do all three at once. Cute little card. Better than a random pirate one. Rizzo, orange Rizzo. Rainbow foil de Luca. And, and, and all this wonderful base. The tops odds page. How do you think I feel, Brandon? I spent half my life going through that to try to make it easy for you guys to figure out what's going on. Made me lose my mind. Bregman, game used. Memorabilia. Verdugo, gold foil.
Scott. Contreras. A lot, lot, lot of nothing going on here. I still had to jump back into that thing. Wade through the waters of the 22-page odds sheet. Man, I'm telling you, if you want a good Andrew Abbott card, join a striker break. What a promotion for striker breaks. Plenty of numbered Andrew Abbott rookie cup cards. Plenty of them. I pull them with ease. Nice, Ryan. Um, we, uh, Ryan, man, we just, we just got that rainbow foil, Ellie. Last break, I believe. Hunter Green, Major League Material. For Eric, Eric is getting some cards. Along with Andrew Abbott, Green. He gets Hunter Green. Coincidence? There are none. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you're new. Oh, I thought maybe. Philly, I didn't see the numbering though, but. Make sure you go back to the beginning and watch the whole thing. I did a special little segment. No wonder. I did it just for you. Colas. Do, 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 do. Phillies, Phillies, Phillies. None of them are five foot two. Brandon with $1.99. Thanks for doing the work, Striker. Keep crushing. Well, thank you for the donation. JD. Reese Olson. And Brandon Nimmo. We got a black parallel Reese Olson auto going to the Tigers, William. Congratulations, William. Reese Olson. Future Cy Young, multiple Cy Young award winning MVP. No hitter, perfect game. Coming your way. Home run challenge, Albies, and nothing. Mm, that's about it. But the three best packs, they remain. Bo Bichette, Encarnacion Strand, decent. Big Hurt. Cunha, Bobby, Bright Breaks asks, "What are the best rookie cards to invest in?" First of all, you shouldn't end a sentence with a preposition. Second of all, you don't invest in rookie cards; you speculate in them. <laughs> Curtis Mead Green. To 99. Bo 
Bowman's best, and then four more boxes of five star. Good evening, John's and Dad sports cards. Bowman's best. We're going to get four autos out of here. Lots of parallels. Lots of good rookies. A wonderful release. And Codman wondering what the best box to buy for 150 to 200. That's a pretty wide margin. Hmm. What would I do if I had 150 to 250 dollars? Man, we're running out of time with those buyback redemptions, but the easy answer is just a bunch of blaster boxes of Topps Chrome before the buyback's over with. I'm waiting to hear back from Bright Breaks. <laughs> I was just teasing you. I hope you didn't think I was uh, serious. I mean, I was serious, but not like, you know. Jazz to 199 Tavares. Wanipa. There's Basalo. Blue parallel to 150. Going to Erica. Solace Refractor. There's Gunner rookie. Jacob Melton. Base auto for Houston. Robert. We got Vlad Refractor. Plenty of Pirates as, as usual. Peguero to 299. Chirio Refractor. Corbin Carroll, real to real. McLean, Burrito, Refractor. And now it's time for the party. The four box. After party. But first. <laughs> That's more like it, stacks and packs. Now we're talking. Now we're speaking properly. I don't know way to build up for an nah, I don't know whoever you like I thought long and hard about it and the, the correct answer is whoever you like you like a guy go ahead and speculate don't like him I don't know chop him up with a knife Not a real guy, just, you know, cardboard guy. Cardboard guy. <laughs> what should I get the kids started in? Series one's a good one. This stuff right here, you see that in a Walmart? You see one of these in a Walmart? Or something? It's a good one to start with. Riley Silver Sigs. Man, that, that pen was running out of ink. 
a little bit. But it's a Riley, number to 40. And another Nolan Gorman. We're getting lots of Nolan Gorman. We're getting a lot of good cards. Congratulations are in order for both William and Clay. Top of the morning, AZ. Yuri Perez, rookie auto. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's Max Muncy with a golden graph. I feel like the golden graphs were on the front, but not this pack. Golden graphs, Max Muncy, number to 30 for Sky. Two more boxes. At least four more autos. Did we already get our juiced? Was that in the first? First stack? The juiced pack? Michael Harris, rookie auto. See, we're in the 2023 stuff. It's weird going back and forth. 23, 24. And Spencer Strider, 31 of 75. Aqua parallel. Michael Harris going to Ben. Spencer Strider. Going to Ben. Both of them. Going to Ben. It's Ben's lucky day. Maybe if I say his name five more times. I mean, he'll be happy because that means he's got five more hits. Dude, did that make it? Lefty over the shoulder? One out of like a thousand. We've got to get in there. Andre Dawson. Expo's hit for the Nationals. Going to Nathan. And the last hit of the break is Jeter Downs. Double Natty's hits. I never liked Jeter Downs as Sig. Okay, one moment and we will look at all the hits for this break. There's a few of them. So we're hitting up five star pretty heavy. Basically, okay, we got a couple days of breaks. Two days of breaks, basically. And then, and then what? And then do we go back in time? I got a couple of treats for some breaks in the near future when we're in between releases. We've got Bowman coming out, but that's not till May. Oh yeah, Bowman Inception is coming out. I didn't I don't know what date that is. Does anybody have a date for Bowman Inception? It's not too far away, is it? Anybody got a date for that? If someone could find that and just drop it in the chat real quick, that'd be wonderful. So that'll be the next thing we're looking forward to. PC ripping, plenty of PC ripping coming your way with Fanatics boxes and Monster boxes. And the final two boxes from my 22 update case and the 2018 hanger box redemption rip. Lots of juicy stuff. All right, let's look at some hits. Bobby Witt Jr. Purple, 6 of 50. Walker Bueller. C.J. Abrams, lots of Nationals hits. Javier Assad, rookie auto. Bo Jackson, another White Sox bow. Yuri Perez with the team border. Looks awesome with the blue and black. It really does. I love that. Gross hands to 15. Another Julio Silver Sigs. Three of 15. Look at this chunker. Six of 15. Matt Chapman on card auto. Enormous patch. 
Autograph Jumbo Patch Relic Card. Game used. I hope the Tigers bring him in. Herrera. Henry Davis. Brito Refractor. Melton. Basalo to 150. Tavares. Jazz. Lava. Curtis Mead to 99. Reese Olsen. Black Parallel. 199. Bregman. Game used. Dawson. 75. Jeter Downs, Michael Harris, Rookie Auto. Spencer Strider, 75. Max Muncy, 20 of 30. Golden Graths. Yuri Perez, Rookie Auto. Riley Green, Silver Signatures. 19 of 40. And Nolan Gorman, Rookie Auto. Woo! Four breaks. Fun times. Five star is enjoyable. I like it. I like the overall checklist. I kind of like the vibe of it. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thanks for watching.